We're at the home of Arsenal here in North London, and everything points to an exciting contest. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And we've got Europa League group stage action coming up for you. How do you see it panning out, Stuart? Well, thanks, Derek. This should be a good game because Arsenal have played some great football so far. More of the same today, and they will be going through to the knockout stages. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Alexander Zinchenko starts with Cedric in the fullback positions. Granit Xhaka plays alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And leading the line today is Gabriel Jesus. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, they're also playing in a 4-3-3 formation, but they play it in a slightly different way, particularly in the wide areas, where their fullbacks will get forward and rotate with the wingers at every opportunity. And this Europa League group stage confrontation commences. throw into Arsenal coming up and very deftly cut out an inability to keep hold of the ball there Well, looking at the table, it might be a celebratory occasion for the home fans because they know their heroes could clinch a place in the knockout stages and with games to spare, Stuart. Yeah, it doesn't matter what goes on elsewhere. Play well, get the three points, and they're through. And it will be an Arsenal free kick. Jesus. Well, lovely work to get past his man. But the danger averted for now. Promising position, this. And saved by the keeper. White. Well read to win possession back. And options in the centre. At times they make passing look easy. And how about that for a save? He has been one of the leading lights in the competition so far, Gabriel Jesus. Well, Derek, I'm sure he's going to score another goal today because he's got four in the last three games. He's a player full of confidence, and every time he makes a forward run, he looks as though he's going to get in behind. He's in outstanding form at the moment. Oh, hang on, Stuart, look at this! That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. Trying to deliver it accurately. He succeeds in clearing it.
Berg. Not an easy one to cut out, really. Berg. Amal Pellegrino. Prepared to take on the shot. And nicely parried away. Arsenal's free kick here. Well, I still don't know how he kept that out, Derek. It's a fantastic save to keep it all square. Must take the lead here. Can he open the door to a potential goal? Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. And over it comes. On the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. Alexander Zinchenko. There's a slide draw pass. And a goal it is. The keeper really not part of the equation. Well, just look at the defending here. They've made it so easy for him in the end. That's just not good enough. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Jesus. Crisp tackling. So, getting close to the half-time interval, and it's going with home advantage, albeit not by a lot. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen so far? Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. And they read it well defensively. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Over the touchline for a throw-in. As you can see, Arsenal are seeing less of the ball, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Not the pass he had in mind. There will be one minute added on at the end. Could be dangerous. Will it happen for them? And there it is, the half-time whistle. And the main thing is they're currently on course to book their place in the knockout stages today. Well, it's job half done so far, Derek. Now they need to see out the next 45 minutes. Keep playing well, stay on the front foot, and they should go through.
Arsenal with the lead going into this second half, but no room for complacency. White holding now. On to Jesus. Granit Xhaka. Albert Sambi Lokonga. And winning it back. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. Well, Gabriel Jesus had a lot to say for himself in the first 45. Sum up his performance for us. Well, it was certainly a good first 45 minutes for the lad. Obviously, he got his goal to put them in front, but he's looked lively throughout too. Hopefully, we see more of him in the second half. An encouraging Arsenal move. Granit Xhaka. And can they prize them open now? He's in with a chance. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Delivering it. He succeeds in clearing it. Marcinelli. And space for him to cut in. Gabriel Jesus. Well read to ease the pressure. And breaking at pace with Menace. Showing patience, looking for the equaliser. It was an excellent example of how to break at pace. Well, that's counter-attacking football at its best. They switch on so quickly when they win the ball back. It deserved a goal. Well, they've decided to make a change. 30 minutes to go then. Well, just to point you in the right direction, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Arsenal facing Manchester City. Gabriel Jesus. It's with Erdogan. Well, visionary passing. He might profit from here, you know. Well, a decent attempt, but just pulled wide. Substitution time it is here. Marcinelli. Gabriel Jesus. And it's there for him. And running through to the keeper. Effective challenge. Gabriel Jesus. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. Can he make it count? Terrific piece of anticipation. Clears it away. Amal Pellegrino. Into the final 20 minutes. Taken away. A real opening now. And he's fired it against the post. Well, it was certainly a chance to get back into the game. And you have to say they're a bit unfortunate. But they do need to finish off one of these chances. Possession changing hands. Gabriel Jesus. Well, he was in the right place to intercept. Gabriel Jesus. Martin Odegaard. And back forwards. The terrific defending to stop them progressing.
moving towards full time and it's a matter of whether or not Arsenal can preserve the victory Stuart, what have you made of their performance? Well, it's been a tight game, but I think they've been the better team. They've just had that little bit more quality, certainly in attack, and of course they've been well organised at the back. They just need to see this through now. Now still pressing for a goal here. Oh, fancy footwork. And pushed onto the woodwork. And relief as the keeper holds on. Well, he reacts so quickly, doesn't he? That's a great bit of work from him. Not a fantastic piece of defending, was it? Unable to keep the ball that time. Good use of advantage by the referee. Bad pass. Patrick Berg. And the attack looks promising. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Lokonga. Can they hit on the break? All hands on deck. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Can he finish them off? Oh, a smart stop. And so that is going to be that. The final whistle here, and they're in a pretty comfortable position because not only have they booked a place in the knockout stages, it's still very much on for them to finish top of the group, Stuart. Yeah, you're absolutely right, Derek. It's job half done at the moment. They'll still want to take that top spot, though. It could make all the difference going into the next round. Well, very hard to keep quiet, as is often the case. Gabriel Jesus, interested to get your verdict. Well, he was a real nuisance today. He always looked a threat, and of course he got the winner.